hey, another week, another new route. And we're aiming for four miles. So thanks for joining. Let's see how this goes. We're trying a uh, two minute run, one minute walk interval for today. Uh, Cause as you can tell. <laughs> We've done one, no two run intervals. This is how we sound. <laughs> All right, so we are on what is called Cougar Trail, and it's grassy, uh, again. Huh? Uneven. Uh, yeah, very. We're on a one minute walk interval. Oh my gosh, it's all uphill. <laughs> okay. We are partially up oh. this incline. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna check our elevation. Yeah. I feel like we just climbed a lot. So, okay, it's just two hundred feet. That doesn't seem bad. Maybe we're whatever. We'll check it when we get down. It's pretty steep. <laughs> Losing our minds. <laughs> Well, it looks like we were wrong. We still have to go up. Oh man. Man, we're having a hard time. We're almost to our turnaround point, but oh my gosh. The elevation and the switchbacks, and we've been going up. Uh, it's rough. But hey, 
beautiful. And we're doing it. <laughs> Anyway, we're at a turnaround point, and this is uh, not like anything we've ever done before, and it's extraordinarily difficult. That's the hardest two miles I've ever run, and I walk out of it. Oh my gosh. I know this is going to sound stupid, but road running is not trail running. <laughs> this is hard. Real hard. Yeah, I mean, we've never run trails like this. Not like this. We've run city trails. Yeah. Uh, I mean, it was, be it was beautiful, <laughs> but really difficult. You know, a lot of side to side movement that we're kind of not used to <laughs> at all. Uh, and uh, we think. We'll verify when we get back, but we think we uh, we went up about 400 feet. Yeah. Uh, but uh, man, we just need another uh, like three quarters of a mile, oh, yeah. and oh, we'll yeah. we'll hit our Ooh. our first four miles here. Yeah. All right. Cheers. <laughs> hey, everybody. Yeah, we're having beer. A well-deserved, hard-earned yeah. beer. Yeah. First of all, thank you so much for Ooh. watching. We really, really appreciate subscribers, non-subscribers. We, we just really like you following along on our, uh, on our crazy, uh, crazy adventures. Um, but if you haven't subscribed, please do. Hit it. Then, then you know, don't do anything. You know, but it helps us. Let us know if you uh, like this video. Hit notifications. You'll find out. We do our best to upload once a week. Do I sound out of breath? It's because I am. We had quite an awesome uh, week two of training. So uh, we're still kind of easing into training. Mm -hmm. uh, I got a chart put together. I figured out our mileages from now until January. That's right. Uh, here's a here's a picture <clears> of it with. Our current status with with some stickers so like last time we're doing a kind of mm, see when in the week you can accomplish these things kind of tactic instead of a on this day you're gonna do this on this day you're gonna do this so we have three categories one for um, well um, I'll, I have some more to say about them in a moment one currently for uh, PT for our physical therapy exercises that really help strengthen our glutes and our hamstrings and um, you know our core and all that stuff that has in the past helped my hip flexor and your knees. Correct, so, and my hip flexor. <laughs> and your hip flexor. Yep. Uh, we have a category for cross training, which is just kind of a move in a different way, do whatever. Last year we called it miscellaneous. This year we're gonna go ahead and call it cross training. Just do something else. Mm -hmm. And then a column for running. And each of those columns has three slots. So throughout the week, uh, three PTs, three cross train, three runs. Three runs is a big deal for us because historically we only run twice a week. Oh, so I was going to say once. At the least, we run once a week. <laughs> yeah. We plan to run twice a week. Yeah. So yeah. I'm, we're going to try to run a little more on this training round um, for a few reasons. 
we're acclimating right. to our elevation and our climate and our mountains and everything else. So I think um, move like a little more running will probably help us out. Mm -hmm. um, but also, I mean, maybe in the end we'll run a little bit faster if we actually run more times a week. I know that's supposed to be the way it works. Yeah, right. We just have never been committed enough to do that. So yeah. we'll see how long it lasts. That's our plan though. Yeah. We did it this week and that's a big deal because we didn't start running this week until Thursday. Yeah. So we ran on Thursday, Friday, Saturday, yeah. which was murder. <laughs> Yeah, it was we, real hard on our, on yeah, our legs. Yeah, we, we ran three miles on Thursday. <laughs> we ran a mile on Friday, which was it really was tough because of the three miles on Thursday. Oh, yeah, yeah. It was yeah. a mile. We were aiming for two, and mm -hmm. like halfway through, I was like, nope. Yeah. And then yeah. today, as part of our you know official training, we ran four miles. It's the longest we've ever run here. Yep. And, oh, man, we, we thought, if you watch the video, of course, let's take this new trail. It looks really, really good. Oh, I really God. thought, I don't know why. I don't know why. Every time we go out... I think it's going to be a flat route, which is ridiculous. <laughs> we live in the mountains now. I know, right? <laughs> my my little brain is not adjusting to the mountains Here's the deal. portion of where we live. Here's the deal. There's no way to escape it. We are doing hill training every, every single, single run. run. So I thought, okay, well, if we're running through the neighborhood, we know it goes up and down. Yeah. What about these trails? Yeah. They look like we see them as we're driving down the main road in town. We're like, oh, look at that. That looks flat. Uh -huh. That looks, yeah, it looks flat in the valley. And then it starts going up. <laughs> so we, we did a trail that um, started off a little, um, a little, what, like three quarters of a mile from our house. So we ran down roads three quarters of a mile yeah. and then took a little offshoot down this trail and went another mile and a quarter. Yeah, and it's a, it's, a, it's a marked trail. It's, mm -hmm. it's called the Cougar Trail. We, we have these, you know, kind of green belt maps mm -hmm. that they gave us uh, when we moved here, and mm -hmm. this is one of them. Yeah, and we saw some people, uh, you know, some on the trail. Very dog. Actually, people. everybody was walking a dog. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, but uh, mm -hmm. if you take a look at this, <laughs> you'll see that we actually went uh, over 400 feet up uh, in elevation. <laughs> yeah, so the first half of that run was real hard. Yeah, it was. Um, we did do interval. Oh, I need to check. Cut. I want to see if it's 45 seconds. Oh, oh it's up here. Oh. Uh, no cut. Uh, so we think we were doing a two minute run, one minute walk. It could have been a two minute run, 45 second walk. After a while, it seemed like a 10 minute run, five second walk. But you know, if you've ever done intervals, you know, you know, you know how that feels, but that's okay. I'm letting it, I'm letting the timer run down now to see how long it is. And uh, by the way, a coach is really excited about this. Cause uh, I stood up. So that right got our attention. She, she's asking for belly rubbins, and now she's asking for a treat. So I might get up in a little bit. So what was it? Um, I have to wait another uh, minute yeah. and 45 seconds. So uh, to the rest. it was pretty good. So thank you all very much for the consensus that the gym boss is the way to go. Uh, currently, we are on a uh, buying moratorium. Sending so, hiatus. <laughs> so, uh, yeah. you know, and, and, you know, coach wants us to get the gym boss, but as we said, we, we, we need to like not spend anything. Um, so, uh, Laura found this really good app. It seems to be working really well. Uh, and, and it's just a plain old timer app. It's not a workout app. It's just timers. Yeah. So that seems to be working mm -hmm. and you're able to set an interval. And so, so far, We've only gone on short runs, so no battery drain yet, but we'll mm -hmm. see how it goes. That's what we're going to use for the time being, but thank you for the suggestion. Yeah. We may end up going with Jim Moss. Yeah, totally. I already when added, we can spend money. Uh, yeah, I already added it to our uh, Amazon wish list. Um, so, uh, what else were we going to say? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. That run was wild. <laughs> so, you know, we're going along. Do, 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 do. It's like, you know, kind of flat-ish, yeah. but up, like, there oh. was an incline up, and I even, like, I think I even... <laughs> Foolishly said, like, oh, well, this will be nice on the way back because this is this is an incline here. <laughs> and then we hit the incline. Yeah. And it was cr like switchbacks to oh, go right. up. Yeah. Uh, very, very steep. Hard to run down. It was oh, so well, steep. Yeah, yeah. We're going to need trail shoes yeah, real again, soon. We still haven't uh, purchased trail shoes. Yeah. Uh, we're on a spending <laughs> moratorium. Um, but when we do, I think, well, no, I know they will really, really no, help. So let's do a cut. <laughs> Because a uh, coach needs some attention. Okay, go, go, go. Action. She's distracted. Go, go. <laughs> Thank you, coach. <laughs> Sorry, it was, we confirmed. <laughs> it was a two-minute run, 45-second walk. 45-second walk. 
five seconds. So that's okay. Yeah, now, somehow, it was still our slowest four miles we have ever run in our lives. <laughs> yeah. It took over an hour for four <laughs> miles. It was over a 16 minute oh, pace. Man. I'm telling you, y'all, it was hard. Oh, man. That second mile. It was hard. That second mile took us 20 minutes. But it was like, it was 400 feet up the hill, man. Straight up. A was, mountain. Uh, you know what? And, and I got to say, I used to mountain bike all the time. Uh, they're awesome mountain bike trails, you know, with all switchbacks and we got some. Kind of yeah. banked, and, and you can, you might be able to see uh, on the footage from our run, but but here's the deal: we did it. Uh, we're slowly acclimating to the elevation. Mm -hmm. I mean, we really feel that if we can if we can maintain this this training schedule, mm -hmm. you know, we'll be we'll be in pretty good shape. Hopefully, for you know the back to back half marathons. Yeah. One thing that, um, the reason earlier that I was like, um, I don't know if this is what our training schedule is going to be or our training plan is going to be. So we have that PT, right, to help strengthen our glutes, hips, you know, hamstrings, all that. Going up the mountain and having to like kind of do a bunch of side to side stuff and climbing all that, my hamstrings are burning. I feel like they're getting plenty of a workout. Yeah. So we may change that category to just general strength yeah. and then sometimes do yeah. our PT and sometimes do other strength. Yeah. Because I feel like just the terrain that we're in right now is going to be, um, I feel like those parts of our uh, lower bodies are going to get more of a workout than they ever naturally have. Yeah. I, I, we, I don't. We've never like truly uh, run trails like we this. We thought we had. And, and, I, yeah, and I say, I say, oh I say during the run, you know, it sounded pretty stupid, but you know, you're coming downhill and it's so steep, right? Uh, you know, that you're, I'm just kind of going side by side and I realize, oh, well, I guess I'm using muscles I never use. So mm -hmm. uh, the feeling is totally different. It, it was really great. And, and again, the weather here is beautiful. It was like 25% humidity. And, you know. Oh, but here's something. Um, about halfway through, I got real hungry. And it's yeah. only a two-mile run. We don't normally mm -hmm. take snacks on a two-mile run. And real thirsty. So something that's going to change is we need to find our water bottles. Yeah. They're still packed somewhere. Yeah. They're in one of our book boxes. I started packing the book boxes with like lighter stuff and all of our running stuff ended up being that stuff and we haven't unpacked the boxes yeah, yet, yeah. the book boxes yet. Yeah. So anyway, we need water bottles with yeah. us next time and we need snacks because we're just doing a different kind of work. Yeah, I got really And I, we were hungry yeah. and we were thirsty, yeah. even on a shorter run. Yeah. So, so we're learning a lot. Yeah. Uh, we're trying to do stuff. I mean, this is week two of our coast to coast training. Uh, we're really excited about it, but we did it. Um, we, oh man, we need, okay, so we need to buy uh, trail running shoes. That's a, that's going to be a must. I know we're yeah. not spending, but that is a necessity yeah. with what we're doing. I mean, I, I, I think we can do this run again with what we have, but anymore, uh, because of the terrain, yeah. our, our road shoes are really getting beat up. Yeah. So We have two more weeks. So next week is a five-mile run. <laughs> the following week is a three-mile run. Oh, okay. Then next week is a seven-mile run. Uh, we should probably have grippy shoes by okay. then. So we have a few weeks to go. Well, I'll go shoes. sell some plasma. So, <laughs> that's our training. Uh, again, thank you so much for watching. But let us know how you're doing. Leave some comments. Uh, give us some tips and suggestions if you've trail run. Uh, we know some of you have. Uh, we've seen your footage. Uh, you know, let us know if you have any tips for us because it really is different. It's really, um, it, it's fun, but it's, um, oh man, it's, it's a little scary. Um, but here we are. Week two of Coast to Coast training done, and our stickers, our chart. Uh, there. Oh, and you may have noticed too, a bunch of rando stickers. Of course, we don't have any PT stickers yet, so you don't know exactly how rando it's gonna be. <laughs> but again, spending moratorium. So uh, we are using leftover stickers from training rounds past. Oh. You may recognize the Tron, the little lightning bolts that we mm. used for our Tron stickers mm. last year. We have some stars that we actually haven't used in several years. Have you dipped into the wine and dine? No, we're almost out of those. Oh, I think no. I used them for something else. Yeah, we're almost out of those. But uh, uh, little Mickey stickers from our first uh, Disney World Marathon oh, yeah. are going to be right. what takes up the uh, strength Fun. column. And we know some of you have set up your training charts. Send us, <laughs> send us your uh, your photos. Uh, you know, let us know how you're doing. We'd love to hear from you. And thank you again for all of the suggestions. Um, and, and just thanks for watching. Uh, we're having a great time because, you know, it is always an adventure with you. We'll see you next week.